Hello everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to another brand new episode of Fisher Online where we are back at Scotland. And today I will be fly fishing. I tried bottom fishing the deep part of this lake. I was getting some cool fish, but it was just a very slow bite rate. I also tried spin fishing here. Again, slow bite rate. So I don't know where bottom fishing is good in this game. I feel like from the dock, if you do the light small lures, uh, sorry, small baits with small hooks for the smaller fish, you might get stuff. But I'm still exploring and trying to find spots. If you already have this map unlocked and you know all the spots, please share it in the comments. I greatly appreciate it. Uh, so far, uh, I've just started fly fishing, as you will see uh, in the rest of this video. And um, I'm having I'm having great luck. Actually, I'm enjoying fly fishing. There aren't too many fish uh, to catch with fly fishing, uh, but it's interesting nonetheless. So let's get started. I really hope you enjoyed this episode, guys. Please like, comment below, and subscribe for more awesome content. So I'm fishing at um, C8 right here in the shallow end. Uh, you spawn over here obviously and you come all the way all the way down here to the left of this area um it's a lake so it's really odd for me but full cast five six seven times right click i think i do i don't know i don't count but it's very rapid and then one retrieve and you get multiple strip technique and maybe this is the fly fishing spot. I'll keep trying and see what we can get. Different flies might work. Maybe one type of fly cat catches more fish at during the day. And one catches more fish during the night. I don't know. Exploring, experimenting. Trying to find something good and consistent. Not looking for just a one-time spot, you know, where I get two quick fish and I'm like, Oh my god, this is a great spot. I just I just want to sit here for a full hour and just make money and catch loads of fish. That's what I want to do. Ooh, <gasps> that's a black grayling. Look at that, 571 gram a grayling of black. Nice. Ooh, I actually got a fish while fly fishing and I'm so excited I was actually sitting upright right by the mic I have since uh, moved back. What is this? Is this the fennec marble trout 2kg? Wow, look at that. Looks like another black grayling. Man, that was a good hit. All right. 1 kg grilling a black. Very nice on the woolly bumblebee. You know what? Let's go ahead and move closer. I think that's good enough. Uh, because anywhere in the shallow end should be good. My bottom fishing rods, I don't think they're going to catch anything. Because it's been a while and they haven't caught anything. Uh, but this is uh, the fly fishing spot. If I have it correctly, all these three meter holes, I believe, should be good for fly fishing. Uh, I really like this area. It's really nice. It's weedy areas. So like if there were bass or other fish, this would be just the perfect cove here. Predatory fish. But uh, fly fishing... Is working here and that's perfect so yes another fly fishing uh, map I mean it's not heavy on the fly fishing but you know besides Poland and what is it uh, Netherland or Finland I don't remember Finally have another map which has a few different types of fish you can catch on uh, fly fishing. 
always welcome that we need another map like poland where it's just fly fishing but i want wolf to uh make fly fishing more profitable or fitable or however you say it because and you know add a lot more fish on that map like pick a river you know that has that's amazing for fly fishing and then add a lot of species of fish there salmons trouts eelheads all that stuff and i think that would be just an amazing map can we get anything else here we just got a non-marker need a nice sized fish here Anything? Oh, okay. I'll uh, I'll keep casting. So far, so good. We got marble. Wow, that was a really big and nice surprise. Uh, wooly <laughs> grilling black. It's just oh god, it's uh it's something. All right. Let's look at this guy. This guy looks cool. I like it. I like the patterns. Two eighteen, two three three, still here. Let's see what we get. Very, it it it's really weird. Fishing stagnant water. Just I've never seen it done. Like I've no knowledge of fly fishing anyway i've never really seen it done but all i've ever heard or seen if i have any uh is uh, fly fishing in rivers in fast flowing rivers or rather just any river but it's never in a just stagnant water pond or lake like we are here so very very unique situation here is this done in real life i have no idea uh, but I can see it happening though, because in real life, even in stagnant parts of the river, um, like there are flies and stuff, you know, like going from the trees onto the water to have a drink or just sit or whatever. And there's like an arowana or some fish underneath that uh, attacks the fish. Sorry, what? Attacks the fly. Uh, so I can see it happening in uh, in stagnant water as well. Just trying and casting everywhere around the boat in the shallow area. And uh, if we don't continue getting any bites, I will move a spot. There are the entire shoreline of this lake is shallow. And I'm assuming on the shallow end will be all the fly fishing fish. There we go. That is a black grayling. Very cool. 1.569 kg black grayling. Let's look at the black graylings here. Damn. 3 kg. Ruben fly, Ruben uh, walking. Ruben walking. So literally just all the flies work, I guess. Uh, what else? Uh, what else are we catching on flies here? Marble trout, trout bait. I really want to try these trout bait boxes because many of the fish have been caught on the trout bait. I just don't know where you will be using these. Crawfish tail. Crawfish tail. Oh my god. There's like literally nothing on flies here. Uh, wasp. What am I using? Bumblebee? Uh, we can switch out to the wasp and try. Bully bumblebee, wasp. Try and throw in the same spot in case there are other fish there. Trout. Don't really like trout in this game because rather worthless. <laughs> I 
But we're going for it anyway, because why the heck not? We can get anything here. Ooh, right at the end. Another black grayling. This one's a small one, though. Uh, 398 gram. Some a good fish here. Uh, this is the bottom fishing I was talking to you guys about. We got a large hattie char, 3.39 kg. That's really nice. And a few Atlantic salmons and brooks. You can see marble. No, marble's on the fly. Yeah, so on bait fish, VIB salmon, GT crawfish. But these fish, as good as they look, did take me time to catch. I don't know how long it took. Maybe 15 minutes, maybe half hour at the very most. 15 minutes to half hour. And that's kind of slow. Um, which is why I decided to just delete all the recording of these fish hair off my bottom fishing adventure and start uh, fly fishing. What the heck I caught also on bait fish hair. So when I came here guys, uh, since you can only fly fish with one rod, on the other two rods I threw them here and I just put a uh, bait fish on. And I ended up catching a small Atlantic salmon here on bait fish. Uh, so it's worth experimenting if you do come here to fly fish. Uh, putting something on your bottom bottom rod. And just throwing out both of your bottom rods. Because you want to be as efficient as possible. We have three rods we can use in this game. And we have three rod holders on this boat. So why not have two bottom rods out while you're fly fishing? Unless fly fishing is so crazy, you're catching fish on every cast within a few seconds. Um, you know, then you can only go get ahead. Go ahead, sorry, with one rod. But in our case, it is not the best bite rate. Uh, so I'm going to try a little bit more. And oh, there it go. Always. That black grayling's always striking right by the boat here. 559. If I throw it just a tad bit out, not too far. Maybe this is, oh god, ooh, look at that. Maybe this is the grayling spot. Empty kapta. One piece. Maybe this is their spawn point. Somewhere here. Uh, maybe we are parked all over it right now. But I've noticed all the last three grillings have been right here by the boat. Okay, just throw it here now. Give me something good. Come on, let's go. Give me a trophy. <laughs> that would just make my day. Okay. Yeah, so I'm going to cast a few more times around here and there. If I get a fish, I get a fish. If I don't, uh, then I'll move and try different spots. Uh, where should I go? I'm going to try here. This is a really big shallow spot here. And then after that, I feel like this end of the lake here might have something interesting. So, yeah. Uh, I think I just hooked onto an Atlantic. Thankfully, it's not too big. It's a 17 kg setup, so uh, yeah, it's easy to get spooled. All right, Mr. Atlantic, what are you, 5 kg? Three point nine kg. Okay, not even a, a marker. What the heck? Uh, marble trout, not a mark. Wow, all of these fish are non-markers. Dang, that's not good. There we go. Got a nice marker here. 
Marble Trout 1.3 just to barely a marker, but I'll take it. Okay, just moved. Um, uh, I will show you guys the spot on the map. But honestly, a Wooly. Uh, Wooly Bumblebee is the best one. Uh, because other flies are only getting me non-marker fish. This might be a non-marker actually. Yeah, non-marker. Uh, but as you can see, just constant non-markers. I can't believe how many non-markers I have here. That's insane. Uh, so looking at all the markers, Bumblebee, uh, Bumblebee, Bumblebee, Wasp, Wasp. So I'm moving back to Bumblebee. I am also right here. That was here initially and I came down here on the map. Uh, I, like I said, I think any shallow area you can do fly fishing but it is very slow i think this cove whatever you want to call it might be the best fishing fly fishing spot uh but even there it's a bit slow and it's really disappointing uh scotland is a high level map a two or 340 silver just to enter that's huge and yet you're telling me that we can't even make that much money here. Like it's not even money at the end of the day as much as it is how slow the bite rate is on everything. It's just trolling and that's it. And that's kind of disappointing because fly fishing needs a lot of love in this game. There are two maps that has amazing fly fishing. One map is all about fly fishing. And uh, I was really expecting more. Not to mention I was expecting there to be good bottom fishing spots like on thousand islands you can go to the deep areas throw crawfish tail or whatever and you can catch a whole a host of fish uh, but that is not the case here it's strictly just uh trolling from what i've experienced i'm gonna try one more spot this is crap i'm gonna try all the way down here at the other other end of the lake and see what kind of fishing that gives us there we go. That's a nice size. <gasps> Whoa. What? Trophy grailing a black 2.6 kg. Yes. Improvement tokens. Ha. Wow. Trophy grailing. I can't believe it. <laughs> Wow, look at that. In the weeklies, I am now in second place. I can't believe it. Uh, so the rest of the map is absolute trash for fly fishing, guys. Unfortunately, I fished here. Um, I also fished right, right here somewhere, I think. Uh, right here. There's like a nice tree and a ramp. A dock, so I thought, you know what, maybe this is meant for fishing. I got one fish, one black grayling on it, but honestly, this is the ultimate spot. Again, it was very slow, I was losing hope. And then all of a sudden, right now, I just got a bite exactly where I threw it. Uh, after reeling it in quarter way, I ended up getting a bite. That is on a Wooly Bumblebee. If you want fly fishing in on this map, a bumblebee is the way to go. Wow, I got a trophy. I'm so happy, guys. I <laughs> followed by a non-marker. But, uh, yeah, unfortunately, just... Uh, I guess it makes sense. It's going to be poor fly fishing because it's just, you know, a lake and not a river. Uh, but it's so interesting. Black graylings live here. And the only way... I guess uh, the next thing to try would... Oh, you know what, guys? Here, I'll give you guys an idea. I should have connected the one and one to make a two, but I completely... I completely messed up. Uh, Ferrix Trout. So if you look at the records here, right? Oops, not this. Uh, it's all flies. You know what? Okay, yeah. Never mind. All-time biggest fish... The grayling was on mayfly larva. But on the weeklies, it's all flies. 
I was gonna say on your boat the other two rods put a small or tiny hook and put mayfly larva and see maybe you can get uh graylings that way in addition to fly fishing for them but wow i was fly fishing e exclusively for the black graylings and uh, we ended up getting a trophy grayling and honestly there's nothing else left on the map to do like i don't think i'll ever come to scotland again because there's just nothing here Ooh, could this be another trophy 2.229 a large grayling a black what 2.6 2.2 what is going on this is the spot 216 233 Looking at corner end of hair during evening at time. Uh, besides this fish, I guess trolling is the only thing I know. You know what? No, I need to try bottom fishing because a lot of the trouts are on uh, the trout bait. And I want to see what the heck that is. And where you can get it. I feel like, it, again, it's going to be in the deep end. Uh, but I do want to catch Orkney Char. I want to catch the Hattie Char. Absolutely beautiful fish. Uh, Ferrix Trout I want to catch. Pawan. Pawan Whitefish. Don't really care about that one. Marble Trout. Yeah. These trunts I've never seen before. Brook Trout. Beautiful fish. And I want to go for them again. So I'm going to... I'm going to try bottom fishing again. But uh, I just... I don't have much hope. I'm going to give it a shot. I'm going to keep... Uh, fly fishing for a little bit more and see what we can get. Ooh, here is a nice piece. Look at this. That's a trout. Finally got a trout. A nice color on it. 1.78 kg trout. Barely any size but you know what i'm happy with that all right we have a non-marker probably but i feel like i've either found the fly fishing spot uh, that's giving me a lot of fish now or it's just the time of day it's early evening uh, that's when i caught my trophy look at this 4 kg 4.4 kg large trout look at these markers here 1.7 kg trout, another black, black, uh, black grayling, and that trophy. And uh, since that trophy, look how many fish all of a sudden I caught. Uh, so it's just into this nook here is what I'm casting. That's where I'm casting and then doing the multiple strips. So you spam your right click then you click left mouse button. And almost every cast, I'm getting a fish. So far, only one cast didn't get me a fish. Uh, but almost every cast, I've been getting a fish. So, uh, it could be it's early evening, that's why. Or it could be that this is the spot to fly fish. Nowhere else, because I'm casting in the exact same spot this whole time. If a spot works, keep throwing it in the same spot over and over ag and over again. When it doesn't work, when you're not getting anything, uh, that's when you start casting in different directions until you find a spot that gives you fish. Then you throw at the same spot again. Obviously, now that I'm recording, the fish are going to be shy and not bite. Not gonna bite. E the trouts exactly. 4.4 kg trout did the exact same thing right by the boat. It decided to strike. 1.6 kg trout. Ooh, a perch. Look at that one kg large perch. What I did was. Uh, I stopped getting bites, so, uh, and I was using a dry fly, that bumblebee. So I decided, let's try a wet fly, because I remember someone saying, 
during the day you're supposed to use I think dry flies and during the night you're supposed to use wet flies. I don't know if that's true. I don't know if I have it reversed or not. Uh, but man, as soon as I put this wet fly, I ended up catching that uh, perch. Interesting. But wow, is this Scotland really dark at night. Those mountains really block out all the starlight. Because, uh, wow, this map is dark. But also, it has been visually improved since uh the last time so yeah all right let's go ahead sell our fish and see what happens server restart is in four minutes of course they want to do it at 8 p.m which is like prime time uh wow 140 silver for this grayling i should have Given it away for, for tokens because 140 silver is absolutely nothing in this game. Uh, wow, look at this 3.3 kg large Hattie char. Very nice money. Uh, Grailing 60 silver. Salmon's making majority of it. But uh, wow, surprisingly, 900 silver is really good. We're at 30 grand now. So uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching. I don't know. I will try bottom fishing again. I'll try asking people if I have to and see where that leads me. And uh, if you know any spots, please let me know in the comments below. Please like, please subscribe. I'll see you next time. Thank you so much for watching. Bye, guys.